last year when the housing market started really favoring sellers, a lot of buyers had to compete and sometimes waive all sorts of contingencies in order to get their offer ratified. I think that can be really nerve wracking. So Scott decided to start helping people do walk and talk home inspections. Tell everyone what that is. Chrissy, a walk and talk consultation really helps the buyer understand the condition of the property. And even though this is not a documented inspection with pictures and a report, it's a real time feedback for that buyer relevant to the uh, condition of the home. Okay, and typically a person that does a walk and talk will have already gone to the house once, decided they really like it, and then um, hire you for your services to go with them or perhaps go on FaceTime exactly. to either do a 30 minute or 60 minute consultation. Right? That is, that's absolutely correct. Okay, and walk us through what does a 30 minute walk and talk entail? Chrissy, the 30 minute walk and talk focuses on not only the interior of the home, such as the furnace, the water heater, and other structural components, but also takes a look at um, infrared imaging to identify any moisture issues. And from there, I would also go to the outside, taking a look at the exterior to confirm there's no issues with moisture, wood deterioration, and even deck safety concerns. Okay, and also you look at the roof, right? Absolutely, okay. from, from roof to the ground. Okay, awesome. Uh, and then if they happen to have the luxury of time and can schedule a 60 minute walk and talk, what do you do for the 60 minutes that you don't do in the 30? Real, the real difference, Chrissy, is the idea that, to go into the attic. Okay. Because when you go into the attic, you can see the roof structure, you can see any evidence of staining from a prior roof leak, or the insulation in the attic, whether it be compressed or missing in areas that could impact your heating efficiency yeah. and your cooling efficiency. This walk and talk can be very helpful in a neighborhood where there may be two homes on the market and someone is trying to figure out what their favorite one is. Right. The walk and talk will really allow you to balance where there's potential for repairs to be flagged as well as even um, further evaluation so you can isolate what is that top priority. Okay, well I think this is great and I think this is a really good thing for consumers to have um, in a competitive market because it's really daunting to just say I'm going to write a contract, no contingencies. Um, I think this provides everyone with peace of mind. It certainly does and it's one way that buyers can walk away feeling comfortable that they've done some due diligence. Awesome. Well, thank you. Thank you. This is a great. It's good talking to you.